we're only going to have three words today. We're going to start with number 18, and we'll just call this vertical angles. I'm going to try and keep it at three minutes for you. And this is still going to be 10-2, so we'll call it 10-2 part B. And we're going to do three words. So vertical angles. Vertical angles, the definition says that opposite angles formed by intersecting lines. I also want you to write down that they are congruent. So I'm going to show you vertical angles. So I'd like you to uh, do this as your sketch. Now when I draw two lines that intersect, you see that there are four angles here. Angle one is right there. There's angle two, there's angle three, and there's angle four. One and three are vertical angles because they're across from each other. Four and two are vertical angles. So I have two pair. A pair means two, so I have two pair, which is four. So over here I want you to write angle one is congruent to angle three. And I also want you to write angle two is congruent to angle four. So I'm going to erase this here quick. And if I do that, I'm going to redraw this again. And if I say, for instance, that this angle number one right here is um, 94 degrees, the angle that it is congruent to is right across from it. It's angle number three, so it is also 94 degrees. So we can fill that in. Now, I can't really cover this up, but if I would erase this right here, and I'll redraw it in a second, if I would erase that, and if you just look at this part right here, doesn't that make a straight line? And how many degrees are in a straight line? That's right, there's 180. So to find the measurement of angle 2, I just take 180 minus 94. And when I do that, what do I get? 86. So this is 86 degrees right here, angle 2. And that continues on, so that means that angle 4 is also 86 degrees. So you should be able to find any of those numbers. I'm going to give you one of these as your secret problem. So I'm just going to sketch two intersecting lines. So I want you to sketch this somewhere. And I'm going to tell you that angle 1 is 138 degrees. You have to tell me the measurement of angle 2, angle 3, angle 4, and um, Tell me what that measurement is, and I'm going to sketch that on mine right now. So, that's your secret problem. Your secret word today is Play-Doh. Okay, we're also going to quick look at words number 24 and 25. Number 24 is parallel lines. Parallel lines, they are two lines, or lines that never intersect. They never cross each other. So my sketch that I'm going to draw looks like this. Now the way that I show that those are parallel, and I'm going to look for these marks on your lines, I draw a little triangle on each one. Okay, so I draw those little triangles there, going in the same direction, and that shows me that they are parallel. Also, the symbol for parallel, I also like to write that down, is just two lines like this. And I'm pretty sure we talked about that in seventh grade or in sixth grade and last number 25 we have perpendicular lines don't forget your quiz that you're going to have today on words 13 through 23 skipping number 18 perpendicular lines you may know this these are lines that cross to form right angles so they form right angles and i'm going to draw a little sketch here and want you to put that in your Notice when they intersect, they intersect in a special way. All of these angles are right angles right here. So it kind of looks like this. They're all 90 degrees. Um, that's all I have for you today. I hope I wasn't too much over three minutes. Bye-bye.